Okay, I wanted to uh, go over GMAX a little bit this time. Uh, basically, using GMAX for Neverwinter Nights. Uh, GMAX download and install. Uh, GMAX, register GMAX, uh, add ons, which is never, uh, or NW Max and Vels Tools, and then importing and exporting MDLs, models for Neverwinter Nights. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and minimize that. We'll go to um, website here. Uh, first, uh, here's the website for uh, GMAX. You download it for free. Once you've got it downloaded and you install it, then you come back to the website here and hit, go to register. When you go to register it, um, then you go to to register GMAX, click here. And then these fields up here is the only ones you gotta fill in, these four. These are down here, if you see it says optional. So you don't have to fill these ones in, just these top ones. Once you do that, I think it emails you or or, or at least it, maybe it just pops up, I can't remember. But then it just pops up a code, you take that code and you plug it into GMAX that you're installing. Okay, so then once you've registered it, like I said, plug the code in, you should be good. Um, then you want to go to uh, Neverwinter Vault or Vault and take in um, download NW Max, which is right here. Um, and then once you download it, uh, and you want to go to Vel's tool, well, actually, you're going to go to Neverwinter Nights Toolbox uh, Editor generator tool and utility collection and you're going to scroll down toward the bottom it's called Vels tools setup right there I'm going to click on that one get that and download that one uh, then once you've got those downloaded oh right here 4g max only with that but anyhow um, once you got those downloaded then you're going to take and put them in put them into um, Your folder for underscripts. There it is. Um, you go to where your GMAX is at. Then there's a folder called scripts. So this is GMAX. You go to the scripts. And then you see here the one I've got Neverwinter Night or NW Max is in. And then the one I got Vels Tools in. Um, therefore, then you have the NW Max one. You've got an NW Max um, exe file here. You want to create a shortcut for that. And put it out here on your desktop, and you're just gonna link it to where your um, GMAX is at. And then once that's done, you'll use that to launch GMAX. Use NWN to, to launch it. By using NWN to launch it, we'll make sure it puts those the plugins in. So right here, you see Vel Tools just came up for me. Uh, so here's Vel's Tools, and here's NWMAX. Uh, so I've got those two extra windows. It's got extra uh, abilities and things on it, but you definitely need NW Max to import MDLs, which is uh, models for uh, Neverwinter Nights. So we've gone over um, G Max, downloading it, installing it, registering it, uh, add-ons, NW Max, and Vels tools. Where to get those at? Now I'm going to go over importing and exporting MDL files, models. So you go to NW Max window, you go to MDL, you do to the file there and or browse, and you're going to go to uh, say wherever you got a model. Remember how in one of the other uh, videos I downloaded a, a model. Or I meant not download, but use uh, Explorer, exported uh, or NW Explorer or uh, NW Hack, one of the two, and export an MDL file, and then you would go to where you're keeping that MDL file at. So, for example, here's an MDL file. So I hit open. Now, once I hit open, then go down here to import, and then it'll import the mod for you. Now I have different windows. Uh, it's like the front view, top view, side view. And then the actual 3D view. If you hit W, 
that'll take you to the big window where the actual 3d view is this is what I usually work out of if you hold down alt at the same time time hold down the middle mouse button or your scroll wheel then you can rotate by holding alt and the middle scroll wheel, sc scroll wheel mouse button I'm holding those two down now to move it side to side back and forth like this that is um, holding control plus the middle mouse button but all plus the middle mouse button lets you rotate it now here's the other thing if I have this selected I'm going to rotate around this object okay if I don't have that selected um, hold on let me I'm going to I just created a copy of that um, I'll go over that here in the next video but so now I'm going to rotate around that object because I got that selected you rotate around the object you have selected so see now if I select this now we're going to rotate around that so that's a key thing to remember whatever you have selected is going to be what you rotate around okay now I'm going to highlight the base that's the royal base down there go up here to this rainbow icon on your right hand side click on the rainbow icon thing uh, make sure you have the royal base selected which is what we got selected right there and then right here oh, right here you got uh, well, I wanted to pull that out for you guys but it's not working with him but anyhow right here is where you have the mod or where you're going to export it to so uh, browse and say I want to put it on desktop for example well under my profile on desktop that is uh, yeah and I say test so I want to export it to there okay and now X and then do sanity checks okay and then export mod Joel, or model boom export now let's go see if it's there and this is the model name by the way that's what's going to be displayed whatever you put up here when you export it that's what's going to export as so if you want to change it that you change that that's naming this royal base down here so let's go see under test bam right there it is and it tells what time it is and date and everything that model was exported so that's how you export it the next video will go over actually how to utilize and work with GMAX a little more and not just uh, this I just wanted to cover downloading installing registering add-ons and importing and exporting MDL file for a uh, model for Neverwinter Nights alright uh, I'll see you at the next video